All right, so today's video is a slightly different vibe. Lindsay just about to take me to the train station because today I'm traveling down to Milton Keynes um, to Papa John's UK headquarters. Wow. I know, maybe I'll get to meet the Papa himself. Do you think he's a real person? I don't actually know if he's a real person, to tell you the truth. It's like Mr. Kentucky, I suppose. He's real, or once was. The Colonel. Yeah. Anyway, Papa John's have invited me down to be one of the first people to try their brand new deep dough pizza. Ooh. Yeah, so I'm, I'm pretty excited. Um, and when I say try the deep dough pizza, I just mean eat ludicrous amounts of it for 30 minutes. So it should be a lot of fun. Alright, so this is Milton Keynes. Never been here before. And I hope I've not offended anyone by saying it's not the most charming city I've ever been to. Anyway, I just gotta try and find my hotel now. Hopefully it's swanky, but I'm not holding out much hope. About 15 minutes away, so no idea where I am right now. I'll see when I get there. Alright, so apart from the fact that this place is pretty much smack bang in the middle of a residential housing estate, it's pretty swanky. Got a big Plasma screen TV back up there, nice little living area with a, a kitchenette back there. The the bedrooms are it's pretty big. This would be this would be great if Mrs. Beard was here. <laughs> Got some free cornflakes too, and uh, some cookies and stuff like that for some reason. And uh, the bathroom is pretty darn huge. Definitely big enough for a. Uh, anything that I'm gonna use it for. So um, yeah, I'm a happy beard right now. I've definitely stayed plenty of worse places than this, believe me. Coffee makes everything okay. And for those of you wondering if I have any kind of like pre-food challenge ritual, I don't really, I don't do anything nuts like drink gallons of water or anything like that. Um, I just have a couple of coffees in the morning and some warm uh, juice just to kind of warm my esophagus up and I try and do that throughout the day. I don't drink crazy amounts, but because I fast, I find that if I don't drink liquid throughout the day, my throat gets really, really tight. And for me, it's better if it's, it's warm, you know? Anyway, I'm just gonna finish up here and I'll see you at Papa John's HQ. All right, so I'm just on set, Papa John's HQ, and they're making up some uh, some pizzas, apparently nobody believes that can do seven of these things. What do you reckon, Reeve? I'm confident in six, seven. Well, they've promised, they've promised you seven gets you a life. Yeah, seven pizzas gets me a lifetime full of free pizza, so I'm definitely doing seven. Are you the man that's making my pizza? I'll be making your pizza. If, if you put anything spicy on my pizza, I'm gonna kill you. No, no, there <laughs> won't be any spicy. Reeves, uh, he's presenting, he's rehearsing about the 
luckily I don't have to speed much, just eat a lot. It's pretty much my thing. Got another YouTuber in the house here, Food Hello. Review UK. Yo. How are you feeling? Looking forward to it? Oh, can't wait. Absolutely can't wait. Yeah. I've been starving myself as well, so. Yeah? yeah. Maybe you should join me in the all you can eat pizza thing. I'll leave that to you. Yeah. I'm not a competitive eater, Apparently, although I might look like it. Apparently, they're going to give me like free pizza for life if I can eat seven of these things. You know, wow. Right, we're just getting ready. Right, we're just getting ready for the, the run through. Food review in the, in the back there. Just getting ready to eat a slice. Make sure you subscribe to this channel as well, it's a cool channel. I don't think Reeve needs my help, but if, if, you don't, if, if you don't watch his channel, go subscribe. It's got like half a million subscribers. Football related stuff. Do you want me to stare like straight into that when he's doing nah, it? No. Nah, just, just play it. I was going to say, it might look a bit unnatural if I'm just like... <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome one and all. This beautiful man right here has created a piece of culinary genius. Today, myself and the rest of the Papa John's team would like to introduce you to the new deep crust pizza. First port of call, however, is we are joined by the beautiful bearded man himself, Mr. Beard Meets Food. How are you mate, doing, mate? I'm doing great. You are great. here for a special reason. And that special reason is we want to see how many slices of Papa John's deep crust pizza you can eat in 30 minutes. So on the clock in three, two, one. Oost! Papa John's, man, it has been a while. Uh, I think the last time I did this was probably, it was definitely more than a year ago, but um, this was a, a really cool day, apart from the pizza being really hot, <laughs> as you can see. Um, yeah, this was a really cool day. Papa John's invited me down to the Papa John's UK head office to uh, to try this new deep crust pizza, which um, is actually really nice. It's um, It looks kind of burnt on the edges, but it, it's not. It's caramelized, and the dough is actually uh, a little bit sweeter than the uh, the regular dough that you get. Beardy, 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 mate. How are you doing? Oh, he's, got, he's got his mask on. I'm doing good. So doing far, right. tastes amazing. Yeah, I'm not sure asking me questions while I was trying to eat pizza was the greatest idea, but uh, I, I don't know what I liked more about this day, the fact that I got to visit Papa John's headquarters, um, which was really cool. The fact that I got to eat pizza for 30 minutes, or the fact that everyone was calling me Beard on set. I think I'm going to go with the fact that everyone was calling me Beard, that was pretty cool. Um, but yeah, this, this new pizza is, is really nice, but the dough is so dense, man. It's like, I thought I was going to do seven of these. Legitimately thought I was going to do seven. Because I think they were only like 12 or 13 inches across. I think it was 12, uh, if I recall. So I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely do seven of these. But uh, man, they were they were heavy, you know, and I had to use a lot of water because they were so warm. I think I went through 10 glasses of water, so um, yeah, a lot of fluid. <laughs> Back to beard, just as reference, we have 10 minutes left on beard, mate. How you doing? Just about to wrap up the four. Four? Yeah. The, the, the dough is really delicious. Um, but yeah, there's quite a lot of it, so um, face there, it's man. slowing me down a little bit, but um, still want to eat it, so. Oh, yeah. A little bit, full ass punk. This slowed me down a lot. I think the first pizza I did in like three minutes, which is okay. Um, I didn't want to go too nuts because they were actually live streaming this, which I probably should have explained at the beginning of the video. Um, so, you know, they told me not to get too crazy with the you know with the mess but um i think i don't know how many i've done by this point um i think i've done four yeah four at this point uh, and they had actually the people watching the live stream guess how many slices i was going to do and i and i think there were a couple of beard army members in there who uh, guessed something insanely high like 70 slices so i appreciate the uh the positivity there but as you can see by my face I'm pretty much uh, spent by by now, especially with the 30 minute time limit. Stage the final hurdle. Beard meets food. 30 seconds left, big man. How are you getting on? Don't answer, just keep eating, yeah. mate. I'll try and 
try, try and cut you through this last bit. I should point out as well, guys, that any answer you gave, it will be the answer under the amount. So, for instance, if he's eating 20 slices and you've answered 19, that's more accurate than 21 because obviously you can't eat a future slice. You know what I mean? That kind of makes sense mathematically. Ladies and gentlemen, that is it. Put your pencils down, as they used to say in exams. Thank God that's over. But, but you, stop, stop your mouth. There we go. <laughs> keep going. Keep going. I'm okay. going. Um, yeah. At this point, do we just check the empty boxes and work out how many you've done? How are you feeling? Confident? You got a mouthful, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Am I right to am I right to go through the boxes? All right. Cool. So, mathematically, we are doing left the chili, mate. What's that? What's that? About? <laughs> 8, 16, it's really going to test my maths isn't it, <laughs> 24, oh sorry about that, 32, and what remains do we have here, is this, is this, you had two off this one, 34 pieces of slices, beard, meat, spoon, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, give that up. Right, so that was a lot harder than expected, but still got a little bit of room left for, uh, some of this cookie. Really nice actually. <laughs>